everyone he is a pretty back with another deck here. Today we have the Fox Targets from Lance Miller. I might be one of the first ones to actually review this for today's. Yay. <laughs> Pretty happy about that. So in front of the box, we have this nice kind of a, almost a retro type look. And you get this nice colored band, a ribbon that goes uh, basically right around the whole thing. It says playing cards, finest quality is an F, established 2014, and then Fox Targets down here. Hey, I like that. How come uh, Zach Mueller can't do something like this? Change it up a little bit. Um, on one side it says slipstream finish with a little fox. Go foxy. On the other side, who let the fox out? No. <laughs> uh, no, what I'm thinking is uh, what sound does a fox make? <laughs> That's it. Murphy's Magic from Point Card Company on the other side with a fox. Uh, Top is the Murphy's Magic logo. The bottom is a barcode made in Taiwan and it says 2016 Murphy's Magic Point Card Company by Murphy's Magic. With the logo, the back you see some nice art. We get some mountain peaks and the sun in the background. Symbols in all the corners. Here we got like a fire symbol, some arrows, some hatchets, uh, a tent, I guess it is. Kind of outdoorsy. There's some foxes down here. Looks like they're hibernating. And, uh, yeah, very interesting. You see that F again. No seal, but you get the ribbon that almost looks like a seal. And foxes on the flaps. It goes a little symbol. And the top case is very, uh, matte finish, I guess. Kind of cardboardy. A little bit different than usual. No embossing or anything. I should mention that Jason Brumble also was involved in the stack. Lance Miller was the artist, and it's quite different than what he used from Lance Miller. You have a couple of jokers that say Joker in the corners, Fox Targets and Murphy's Magic Point Card Company, and they, there's a fox on there. The other one, same thing. The back design, very interesting. It's a pale blue, almost a grayish color with the F on there. Like I said, I mean, this could easily be a Fontaine deck, and it's not. It's much better than a Fontaine deck, that's for sure. But I just say, like, Zach Miller could make something like that and change it up so it's not always the same thing but let's get back to fox targets and unfortunately i'm not sure exactly what fox targets is or what it represents these are spades are this little spade pip within this artwork it says fox targets murphy's metric point card company little fox in there you see the flames and the hatchet kind of about survival custom indexes and pips throughout the aces have bigger pips very nice. We need to get to the court cards. Um, spades and clubs are just black and white, basically. Lots of detail in there. Not a lot of color, but lots of detail. All sorts of stuff going on in there. Very nice. Hearts and diamonds actually have reddish colors, as you can see. Almost a purple, pink type color, really. And the number cards, custom pips, and the layout of the pips. Standard colors. And that is that. Um, like I said, pointed in Taiwan, it doesn't actually say that it's expert pointing cards or legends. So obviously they're working directly with that factory now. It's the Murphy's Mad Card Company printing, <laughs> we'll say. Um, ooh, got some sticky stuff on the table. Um, anyway, so the cards, slipstream finish, they handle pretty decently. They might need to be worked in a bit more. But, I mean, for the most part, pretty good. 
Uh, I would say it's definitely a very unique deck. It's definitely different artwork wise and the faces and the backs and the colors and everything. Handles pretty good. Um, definitely one of the better ones for Mercury's Magic in my opinion. So I'm gonna say 9 out of 10. And you can get this from Lance Miller's website. I'll put a link down below. It's also available for most card magic shops. Check out collectiblepointcards.com. Use the code BTOZ32 and save 10% on you. That's what I got. I'll see you next time with more. And also thanks to Lance Miller. He's, I believe, sending me a deck, although I already got one. Uh, but I appreciate it. And then maybe a giveaway. We'll see. So I'll see you next time with more.